What's up, dudes, and welcome back to another video of Tristiano's stuff. Today, we're going to be talking about ethyl, or based on some information that I'll tell you in a second, ethyl. I'm still going to say ethyl, because ethyl sounds weird. Uh, I'm sorry that I move so much. I'm goofy. But, um, yes, good old ethyl, or ethyl if you want to be weird, and I don't. I just need to get that out of the way. Um, is a what is called a ligature, um, similar to ash, and I didn't actually know that that was a term for what this is, but a ligature is the combination of two letters, or graphemes, as they are technically called in linguistics, um, to make one grapheme, or a letter. Um, so, like I said, ash is an example, um, and ethyl. Ethyl is the O version, the O-E now, ethyl evolved from two separate Latin alphabet letters, um, which I think is pretty obvious because it's a combination of O and E, which still exists and were definitely around when ethyl became a thing. Um, but they made the sound in classical Latin pronunciation, oi. For example, the word foi deratarum in the Pledge of Allegiance in Latin, um, best translated, foi deratarum um, is... Um, I think Republic, one of, it's a term in the, um, Pledge of Allegiance. I could go through it right now, say it out loud, but that's something for another video and would take too long, probably. Um, but the point is, one second. Okay, um, it is the United States part, is what Foydertarum is, United States, um, I think, I don't know, but the point is, Foydertarum, um, has the oi sound, the o-e, towards the beginning, um, and in classical Latin, that's how it what this would it sounded like, but in um, medieval and early modern Latin, the sound transferred to more of a e sound um, instead of an oi, it's an e, um, and that's how it how we see it now today. The word onomatopoeia, for example, uses an oe separate though instead of ethyl. Um, towards the end, the pia, it's E I A P -ia. Um so it the E -a sound is an E -a sound. Um but the spelling there is O E I A, which I think is very odd. Most people are like, why is it spelled like that? Well it's because ethyl. So the E sound is what's created by the ethyl letter. Um and yeah, I mean it's not the that fun. It's like Ash's slightly less cool brother, slightly less interesting homie essentially. Um, but I mean, there's some interesting history and background to it, as well as any letter in the fun letter series. I forgot to do that. Also look at the map and appreciate, appreciate. That's a weird way to say appreciate, uh, but appreciate the lighting. Despite the fact that it's sort of blurry, it's better, I'd say. So yeah, appreciate it. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I'm also really kind of running out of things, so please recommend me some letters, alright? Uh, subscribe if you're not already, like the video, um, comment down below what you'd like to see in future videos, um, more, what more I can bring to the table, what more content, you know, what, what you'll want to see, if y'all like the series so far, if you do like it, obviously, and comment down below why this video specifically, like it, um, tell me what you liked about it down below. Uh, subscribe, like I already said. I'm going to be very redundant. Um, just, just, like, do everything good for the channel. Um, and if you don't, I appreciate you for viewing. Appreciate. That's funny. Um, but yeah, anyways, thank you, everybody. Subscribe. For not, not liking the videos or liking them, all right? I appreciate y'all all for viewing uh, in the first place and just for being here. Just, like, existing. So, yeah, thank you. And goodbye, everyone.